I have an axe to grind and today it's with Canada Post. Now, they're not the only ones guilty of this because I've had the same thing happen with FedEx and UPS. But today I'm picking on Canada Post because this bullshit continues to happen time and time again. I have a user that is, uh, I have people sending me equipment to be repaired. In this case, it was an expensive Super VHS Sony VCR that was shipped up by mail. And here's the Canada Post guy coming up to do the delivery. Now, over the last couple of years, I have had many items stolen. Most of the stuff that's been stolen has been new products that have been shipped out for me to review. And of course, the person that sends it are the ones that are at a loss there because uh, they, they don't get the review. Sorry, the camera's shaking there. I'm having a hard time holding it steady. I'm just pointing it at the monitor here. Um, but I've had many items stolen. So I have a sign on my door that says, do not leave anything at my front door. And for a while there, they were taking them around back like I had requested. But lately, it seems like they just don't give a shit, maybe because they're having their little pissing contest with the government and their little labor dispute. But in this case, this was a Sony SLVR1000. Now, anybody that knows what these things are worth, they're worth quite a bit of money used. They go for, you know, five or $600 on the used market because they are a super VHS machine. I have one being sent up to be repaired. Here it comes. The guy's still fiddling around. I don't know what's taking him so long to take a package out of the truck. But uh, this was delivered at about, uh, I think it was 5 after 10 this morning. I didn't get home for lunch until like 11.30. But here he comes up to the door. There he is, Mr. Posty. We'll get a good close-up of you in a minute here. And he's just going to take it and he's going to drop it at the door rings the doorbell right in front of him there's a sign that says specifically do not leave anything at my door because of the theft i've had so many things stolen there's probably been five or six things that have been stolen in the last year now incidentally about a year ago um i actually confronted one of the postal workers and i said i said to the guy when he dropped something off at my door i said excuse me he said do you know how to read and he goes what do you mean i said do you know how to read and the guy says yeah why and i said what does the sign say he says to me oh, uh, we're not allowed to take it around the back. And I said, well, don't leave it at the door. Put a card on the door and I'll come and get it at the post office. And he said, well, I can't do that unless it says signature required, which is bullshit, okay? Total bullshit. I don't want stuff left at my door. I don't think anybody wants anything valuable left at their door, especially when it's wide open and anybody walking or driving up the street can see it, right? But this continues to you know and he's placing it out of out of sight of the camera too i can't even see that it's there if he put it on the other side i could see that there's a package there when i do check my cameras during the day i i do log in and check them if he left it on the other side i'd be able to see it and i could actually make, make arrangements to go and get it but he's dropped it out of sight of the camera and he's going to ring the bell he's looking right at the sign it's right in his line of sight he's staring at the sign that says don't leave it at the door yet he leaves it at the door and just takes off and this is something that just really pisses me off because i've actually had a chat with this particular uh, uh postie and he was off for a while and a guy replaced him and the guy that replaced him would take everything around to the back but now this guy's back and he just doesn't care and i'm just getting a little bit pissed off with him so here's my reaction when i came home at 11 30 and found this sitting at my door i really have an axe to grind with canada post you see i arrive home and there's a big box with a client's SLV R1000 propped up against my door, despite that there's a bloody sign here that tells Canada Post to drop all packages behind the back door. And they leave it at my front door. I've had more things stolen from these assholes at Canada Post that just don't seem to know how to read. If you have a problem with Canada Post, let's let them know that we don't appreciate this crap. Because if this got stolen, guess who's on the hook for it? It's not them, it's me.